We can now customize our own furniture. If you don't know where to start with this new feature or you're looking for inspiration, I will walk you through step by step to create this gorgeous and super easy to do furniture set. Hi everyone, I'm Cupcake and let's get started customizing our furniture from the customized category. If you're interested on a specific piece of furniture, you'll see the timestamps in the description below. Let's start by creating a new rug. Let's open our main color picker and for the material, we're using the one that is on the left of the wood just to get a realistic background. And we're using this baby blue for the color. Now let's start creating our beautiful cherry blossom branch with this boot motif. Yes, we're going to create magic with this. So let's make it as big as possible, rotate and place it at the far corner. Now we're adding two more boots with the same dimensions and just place them in a way that looks like the branch is continuing. Bear with me, this will look awesome. So something like this. To erase any boot traces, we're placing the circle with the same baby blue on top of the boots and we're moving our first boot motive to the top. Now if this is not Disney magic, I don't know what is. <laughs> Let's start adding some of our cherry blossom flowers on top to cover some of the imperfections. And actually, we're adding one more branch at the bottom right corner, just a bit smaller. And I just added 10 flowers in total with the same dimensions. Let's place them around. I'll just add some on the branches and some kind of flowing with the wind. Awesome. Now we have our gorgeous Sakura Blue rug. Great! Let's move on to our beautiful chair. So we're using the same material, the same color as our rug. And the second color for this is the color of like the structure. So for this set, we're making some kind of light rattan. So let's choose this material on the second row and I feel this last color looks a bit more natural so we're choosing that. We'll have a bit of cherry blossom variation here with the cherry blossom bundle motif and just a few cherry blossom flowing with the wind and if you see that I'm using the mirror duplicate it's because I feel sometimes it's the fastest way to duplicate a motif. Awesome. That's it for the chair. It's super easy. Let's now go with our table. We're using the same color material and we're using the boot motif again. And let's make this as big as possible and add our other two boots like we did for the rug. Cover them with the blue circle and move our first boot to the top. Cover the imperfections and I placed nine flowers in total and I'm just placing them around something like this. Gorgeous. The shade lamp is my second favorite piece for the set and is the easiest to do. We'll choose the same texture, color, and of course the rattan look for the legs. Then we'll add a boot motif at the bottom, mirror that so we have it on the opposite side as well. And this time we'll include a bundle at the top of the branch. Mirror that to place it on the other side as well. And that's it. Easy peasy. For the bed, we're starting with the same texture, color, and rattan. Then continue adding our boot as big as possible. Move it to the corner. Then we'll add a few bundles this time. As small as possible. So we're placing four of them on the branches around there just like that let's add a single flower here 
and mirror that and add another towards the center mirror again and place one at the middle and just fix it so we have even spacing awesome now let's add another flower bundle for the big pillows just big enough to cover the pillow completely and mirror that let's add a simple square to cover the accent pillow with the darkest shade of the blue mirror that to cover the other pillow as well then add a bundle on the corner for both pillows and i'm just looking to see those two little flower buttons hanging here just because i think they just look really cute and now you have an amazing bed now let's make our double couch same texture color and rattan using our boot motif again on the corner of the cushion for both sides then i'm going to use individual flowers for this but i'm removing the sphere option to make them even smaller then just add two on each side something like this then let's add a bundle for this side mirror that and i want this to look a bit rounded so we're adding another mirror pair just looking that the buttons are on the sides and they look kind of symmetrical and the final touch with the single flower on both sides awesome now let's add a super easy to do basic desk same texture our blue and our rattan adding our boot on the corner and i'm going to add six individual flowers and just spread them around on the branch and just flowing with the wind great for my favorite piece the dresser we're starting the same way so same texture, our blue and our rattan. Let's start with our boot and make it as big as possible. Then we'll add three bundles on the branch. And the reason I love this so much is because of these flowers and adding to the front. So we're placing them at the corner, then mirroring them. Do the same for the bottom. And I just think this looks gorgeous. Some color variations to try are pink that looks gorgeous. The only thing is that for the tree boots version, the circle does not blend well with the background, but you can definitely choose to use just one boot instead. If you want it darker, the gray color looks amazing as well, and you'll have no problems with the circles. All the pieces look amazing together. So in my next video, I'm going to use them for a beautiful Sakura room that looks fantastic with the new Fairy Godmother's items. So stay tuned and feel free to give a like if you like this video and subscribe if you're interested in more, of course. Thank you all for watching and I hope you have a very sweet day.